A visual inspection of the hatch cover construction and the hatch cover seals complements an ultrasonic watertight integrity test. The 10 most common defects with hatch covers and hatch cover seals, as recorded by the North of England Protection and Indemnity Club, are 1. The seal is set beyond the point of replacement. If the seal is heavily set in, then the metal edge of the hatch cover will rest on the metal top of the hatch combing, and there may not be sufficient compression between the rubber seal and the compression bar to produce a watertight seal. 2. The seal is worn, torn, displaced or missing, including cross joints. If the seal is worn, torn, displaced or missing, then in the particular area of this type of defect, the seal will not make contact with the compression bar and the seal will not be watertight. 3. Temporary seal fixes. Temporary seal fixes are often uneven and do not form a proper seal with the compression bar. 4. Wastage of steel support pads or cover side plates. Worn steel support pads and corroded hatch cover side plates can cause misalignment, which can be the cause of leakage. 5. Blocked drain holes. If drain holes are blocked or are not fitted with non-return valves, then water can build up and overflow the drain channels. 6. Wasted cross joint drain channels. Wasted cross joint drain channels may not be watertight. 7. The cross joint cleating or alignment is faulty. If the alignment of the hatch covers is faulty or the cross joint cleats are faulty, this can lead to loss of water tightness. 8. Cleats and support stools are wasted or missing. Wasted cleats and support stools means that it is not possible to get good compression between the hatch seal and the compression bar when the hatch cover is secured for C. 9. Holes in steel plating due to corrosion. Corroded stiffness can weaken hatch covers, resulting in misalignment. Corrosion of the hatch cover plates will, if not attended to, eventually lead to holes in the hatch covers. 10. Worn centerline wedge devices on side rolling covers which cause cross joints to open when the ship is at sea. If the centerline wedge devices on side opening hatches are worn, then the cross joints will open when the ship is in rolling motion whilst at sea. These common hatch cover defects have been given as a guide. Hatch cover defects may take many forms and are not limited to the 10 most common defects that have been shown in this training programme.